Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. Um, today I'm just going to do our <clears throat> weekly grocery shop and I'm just going to Walmart. I pretty much never go anywhere else other than Walmart. On a rare occasion I'll go in Kroger or in Sam's, but um, honestly I don't even want to have to stay out long. I kind of don't even feel like going out today, but I've got to do what I got to do. Our area is so overrun, like the pickups and grocery deliveries, a lot of times you're not guaranteed that you'll get your things. And in the past, I've placed orders. Um, my mom and sister have had the same thing happen. Whether you do pickup or delivery and it'll tell you like it's being delivered or it's time to pick up, whatever. Mainly it happens with delivery, but um, you'll get ready for your time slot or whatever and your groceries won't be there. And when you call, they'll say like, oh, they're delayed or they're on their way or whatever and you will literally call for two or three days trying to get a hold of somebody and most of the time they don't end up delivered and then your money is tied up in your account for like a week or more so needless to say I can't rely on that being our primary source of groceries right now I'm buying a small amount and a lot of it is like produce items that's mainly what I'm getting today I think probably half of the grocery list is um, produce items so yeah, Shriner's appointment where Willow got her leg and ankle foot braces. We have had such a dilemma with getting shoes for them. So I explained in my previous vlog, which will be the one, but I guess before this. Yeah, so I explained in there what was going on. I tried to be a little more lengthy in it. I'm going to try and see if I can find, it doesn't have to be a grand shoe, just like something that will actually fit around and over the brace. So, hopefully, I can find something because, I don't know, everything they recommended and told me to get did not work. And I, I don't understand how it's something they could recommend and it didn't work for her because it, she's got the same leg, foot, ankle brace that any other kid or baby would have. But, anyways, that's what we are doing with our day. I will do a haul when I get back. She's eating her breakfast right now. And then this little plant right here recently started budding some. The basil is still growing so slow, thinking maybe it would have done better outside. The cilantro is growing well, but I feel like it hit a point where it just kind of stopped a little bit. But also, I think one day when Michael closed the curtain that he hit it and made them fall over. So, yeah. Apparently, parsley and green onion is what I need to focus on growing in my kitchen area. <laughs> Yummy. So, we are done at Walmart. Ugh, I'm getting like chest freeze, brain freeze. Um, I had to stop and get Willow a few french fries. She has fruit and vegetables and milk and juice and all that throughout the day. But, usually like as a Friday treat, I'll get her some fries at uh, Chick-fil-A or something. Um, I wanted something sweet and all I had today was half of a bagel. So, I got the ice cream or ice cream cup. I didn't realize there's only like 150 calories in the little cup, which is really good for like a lower calorie dessert. So I'm eating that and then when I go home, I'm going to make like a chicken bacon Caesar wrap for lunch because I don't know why it was a random craving I had. I'm literally just going to make like a chicken Caesar salad and then put it in a tortilla wrap. But um, y'all, when I loaded the groceries... <laughs> I think it was like 156, it was like 155, 156. I really think we had about nine bags maybe. Of course I'll do the haul when we get home, but I just could not get over, I, like I'm grateful for every little bit that we are able to do, but it, it took me maybe 10 seconds to lift all the bags out of the buggy or the grocery cart, we call them buggies, and put it in the back of my car and I was done. It's just crazy. And it was 150 and I was trying to spend like 80 but I mean, I literally bought one, was that one? Like one extra thing. I actually put two things for myself back because I was like, no, I don't need it. And I'm trying not to go over and it would have been like $30 more. So I put it back. 
I found two pair of shoes I'll show that um, I got to work with Willow's foot leg braces, but still I just, there went the milk. Anyways, um, still, I just, I really see this being a problem because the shoes have to be so much bigger than her feet to fit it. And I feel like it's going to cause another issue. If she's turning around and tripping and falling constantly because her foot, her shoe is tucking under her because it's not custom to her brace. Um, I, I just don't see how that's any better than not walking fully. Like, I don't want to fix one problem and create another. It was absolutely crazy out there. I tried to get gas at Sam's. Couldn't even do that. I had to go to different gas station. There's just a lot of people out with graduation and summer and all that coming up. But this is our Walmart haul. I think I mentioned earlier it was 156 And I, I just don't know how. It just it doesn't seem like that much. But just kind of a quick overview. <laughs> Please ignore the dishes in the sink i was so tired yesterday we've just been going so much we have so many appointments and things i just i needed a break so i was like you know what they can wait till today so i'm about to put these up and get willow started with some lunch if she'll eat it and then wash the dishes but starting from over here i got some broccolis i'm doing a lot of food prep for when i have my dental procedure because i'm just going to eat like a lot of soups and stuff so i'm going to make my low calorie broccoli cheddar soup that's what this is for then i got some fully cooked bacon I'm craving like a chicken Caesar salad wrap, which is what I'm going to have for lunch. But also I'm going to put some of this um, chipped up in, I can't even remember what recipe it is now. I think it's like a chicken bake recipe or something. I don't know. But mainly I got this for the Caesar wrap. And then I also got more large flour tortillas to make my wrap with. I'm probably going to make two. That way I can have another one tomorrow for lunch. And then Michael can have like a quesadilla for dinner. I got a... Um, Bel Gioioso Asiago Romano Parmesan Salad Cheese Blend. These are really good, and it's actually a good deal compared to the one that has more preservatives and stuff. And then I got a plain Parmesan. This is for the wraps I'm going to make. And then also I am prepping some chicken and gnocchi soup for my dental procedure soups, whatever <laughs> that I'm prepping. Then I'm going to use the grilled chicken for um my chicken caesar wrap y'all will have to excuse willow's cartoon going in there but um anyways i buy a bag of this a week sometimes i'll make a quick dinner with it i'm gonna make a wrap right quick for lunch and then i also got some light creamy caesar dressing for that got some mozzarella for some chicken bake things i think people call them like a costco chicken bake we don't have a costco but i got pizza crust which i'm gonna go ahead and stick in the fridge because it's quite warm out there today and um i just saw the idea online so i'm gonna do my own version of one and then, um, I think I was like over here. Oh, <laughs> and then I got four things of taco seasoning, just a, I know it's like literally pennies, but it's all adding up these days, but a tip, we like the Taco Bell seasoning mix for eating actual tacos. It just tastes so much better. But if I'm using a recipe or making like taco soup, you can't tell the difference in these. So I get the great value brand because it's about half the price. This is like right at 70 cents and this is 40 cents. So it's changed, but it adds up because everything is going up. Got some of these for Willow. These are her favorite. Last week, I think I paid $1.94 for this. This week, it was $4. I, I really don't get the cost right now. Um, I got a cucumber. This is for her. And then sometimes I end up eating just a little bit in a salad. But I'm going to make a sushi bowl. a um, Or actually, it's called like a salmon bowl. I think it's a TikTok thing, but I'm not on TikTok. I, if I can remember, I'll put the link in my description for how I do mine. Got some carrots to go in the broccoli cheddar soup, and then some also go in the chicken and gnocchi soup. The bacon bits are for, I'm also making Zuppa Toscana, but I'm not going to put like like the Olive Garden one. I'm not going to put the um, potatoes in it until I cook it, but I'm going to pour the bacon bits. Bacon bits work better. Then I cook the Italian sausage where we can have that. Michael will eat that one whenever I'm on my soup journey. <laughs> the spinach is for the chicken and gnocchi and I think there's something else that I need a little bit in tomatoes are for my wraps and maybe for a salad lettuce the same thing some aluminum foil more pouches we get those every week some wipes 
a Glade or Febreze plug. Those last forever, and this one smelled so good in our living room the other day, and um, I needed a new one, so I just got the one. Got some of these. Been trying to get Willow to eat at least half of one a day because it's something good and filling. The whipping cream is for soup, or two of the soups, maybe even three, I can't remember. And they freeze fairly well, so I'm going to try freezing part of the soup mixture and just not putting all the whipping cream in. I'll just leave it in the fridge. Got the two juice for Wick. I didn't get it the other day. I got these teensy snacks right here. It's supposed to be like, I think like a fruit snack for a baby. I've been grabbing a little random snack here and there for when we go out to doctor's appointments just because sometimes she's really picky and doesn't eat much. Got the Pepsi Max is what it used to be called, but it's called Pepsi Zero Sugar now. But um, this is the best deal. Cokes and things are like $7 a case. This one's 6 and it's 15 instead of 12 so I got that. I found these shoes right here to fit over her brace, but um, I already explained. These are a size 6 and she is actually a size three and a half, so they're very big, but they're lightweight, and I honestly just don't know what to do at this point. I'm going to actually bring the shoes and braces with me to her appointment next week and show them my issue. And then this was, no joke, y'all, from Target, Old Navy, and Walmart. This is the only shoes that even mildly, um, they were the only ones that even mildly went around her brace. So I just grabbed the two because, I mean, this was all they had, and they said that she doesn't need like a great shoe it's just she needs a sole so they said crocs blah 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 whatever none of that worked so i just grabbed the two that did work one's a five one's a six i don't really know what else to do at this point i've looked online for like custom things and all i i just don't know so so we got what we got until we can figure something out i got a tank top or a camisole thing to go under my shirts i have some that are a little bit too low for me to wear but I can't find my black tank top and it was really old anyway, so I grabbed that. Got some cherries for me. This is one of my favorite snacks. Fruit cups for Willow, some celery for the soup and meal prep. And sometimes Willow will eat some as a snack. I'm sorry if I'm all over the place, guys. I'm trying to hurry up so much. And then some Kraft mac and cheese. This just sounded good. Then I got some garlic. I like the squeeze tubes, but you can only get the organic kind now. And it's $5 and I'm just not about to spend that much. Whipped cream cheese for bagels and also for the salmon sushi bowl, whatever we're having or I'm having for dinner. And yeah, that's $156 worth of groceries for the week for a family of three or I always joke and say two and a half. I'm going to go ahead and get all these put up while Willow is eating lunch and get my lunch going and then clean the kitchen and clean the house and all that. And then we have been gone nonstop. So I really just want a good relaxing do nothing day and then we have three appointments coming up next week so i definitely want to get it all clean and all done this evening where i don't have to worry about it but that's another vlog for another day i guess um but anyways thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe and comment and say hey as always i feel like i repeat the same thing every time but i guess it is what it is so so i guess i'll see y'all next time bye say bye Every time I say bye on the vlog, she says as soon as I click the stop button, she goes bye.